All right, Penn State fans, it's the final Penn State Penn Live this week in Penn State Football Studio Show in 2018. I'm Greg Pickle. We are not in Florida just yet for the Citrus Bowl, but the Penn State Nittany Lions. Head coach James Franklin head there on Wednesday. We are recording this before the team arrives, so stay tuned for any new updates or roster availability changes that may take place once the team arrives. However, James Franklin has said recently that he expects his full team to be on hand and play in the Citrus Bowl. However, we know things can change from past experience experience once the team gets to the bowl location, so stay tuned for that. As for the matchup, January 1st, Kentucky versus Penn State is going to be aired on ABC, and the Lions are still about a 6-7 point favorite depending on where you look. The total keeps bouncing around between 44, 45, and 46, but odds makers are looking at points in this game a little bit as Benny Snell, the Kentucky running back, is expected to play, even though he's already declared for the NFL Draft. Wildcats star defensive end and linebacker Josh Allen also expected to play, as are all of Penn State's guys considering the NFL, which includes running back Miles Sanders, offensive lineman Connor to McGovern and so on and so forth. Defensive end Sharif Miller makes that list as well. So stay tuned for updates. We'll be live there Friday and we'll be bringing you plenty of coverage from Florida. You can always check us out penlive.com slash Penn State football. Also youtube.com slash all Penn State. One quick note before we get out of here on the recruiting front, Penn State did receive a Christmas gift uh, on, on Tuesday when class of 2020 four-star linebacker Derek Wingo committed to the program. It's another good get for Penn State. They just signed Brandon and Smith five-star and Lance Dixon a four-star in the class of 2019. Both of those guys will enroll in January. Wingo, of course, can't sign until next December, but he's a top 200 player nationally, according to the 247 Sports Composite and the number 10 outside linebacker in the junior class. So he is a guy that Penn State has been targeting for quite some time. He's close with John Dunmore, the receiver who signed in the class of 2019 for Penn State. And it's another win for Jaywan Sider, their first year running backs coach who really recruits Florida well. He goes down, he gets Wingo. It was a Christmas Day surprise uh, for the family and for Wingo and for Penn State, but good news on that front. It's the Lions' second class of 2020 commit. He joins Grant Toussaint, a three-star lineman from Michigan. All right, it's time for us to get out of here. Like I said, penlive.com slash all Penn State, or I'm sorry, penlive.com slash Penn State football. That's where you can find the latest news and notes. Videos can be found youtube.com slash all Penn State. Hope you enjoyed the holidays, and we'll see you soon from the Sunshine State for Penn State and Kentucky in the Citrus Bowl.